just an SAP mm -hmm. start. Uh, so yeah. Okay. okay. Uh, maybe so I have. Uh, yeah. Just my work says uh, just an SAP. So may I start? Okay. 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 Let's yes. start. Okay. So thank you for coming to my talk. So. I'm talking about uh, so latest review of this uh, open source Linux 15 or several uh, Linux distribution, for example, as a distribution. I always use Ubuntu or something. So, uh, I'm so uh, who am I? So I'm Narihiko Masara. Uh, come from Tokyo, Japan. Uh, I'm a Document Foundation member and Review Office Japanese team. Uh, member. The Google Japan team is a Japanese Libre Office name with this project. So, to people who want to, uh, to use uh, Libre Office by their native language, I mean the Japanese. So, and uh, so I'm a uh, so Japanese Libre Office user, user interface trans and help translation combinator. Okay, so I will talk uh, in this session, I will talk about uh, so. What the river? Maybe so everyone knows the river. I, I don't need to spend too much, uh, much time to this, but uh, so I uh, will tell something. And uh, so open source and the river office. Then, uh, so I want to talk about the modern packaging three, modern packaging system, flat pack, snap, and uh, app image, and conclusion. Okay, so maybe so everyone knows the river office, right? No one? No? <laughs> no, 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 so no. So everyone knows that uh, LibreOffice, but uh, so tell something. So LibreOffice is a uh, so proof features Office product suite uh, and, and this uh, license, uh, open source license. Uh, it's, of course, it's open source software. This is a uh, so critical part of desktop Linux like a Unix like distribution, like Linux or BSD or something. Uh, like OpenSUSE or Ubuntu or Fedora or something. And of course, uh, we can use a LibreOffice with a Windows or Mac or several uh, other operating systems. Multi platform is just a uh, strength of the LibreOffice. And uh, we have a time based release uh, strategy, you know. So we release that uh, so six months each major release and uh, one month uh, my, uh, each minor release. So, and, uh, so our version is a one point, uh, six point one is a major and zero is a minor uh, version. So we have to say that we have a release six point one, six point zero, or six point uh, five point four. Uh, so don't say level of four or level of five or something. And uh, yeah. We have a last major release version supported. Uh, we, so this is called uh, this uh, fresh and still. Uh, country Libre uh, six point one is a fresh release, and Libre Office six point zero is a still release. So uh, it means uh, uh, we have uh, two stable releases uh, in the same time. So and. Uh, uh, OpenSUSE and the LibreOffice, about the OpenSUSE and LibreOffice. Of course, OpenSUSE officially provides the LibreOffice package. So in this URL, so you can see. And of course, uh, this is the uh, uh, OpenSUSE pre-installed uh, LibreOffice with KD or GNOME desktop. So right, as a distribution. And, uh, I think it is a correct idea, but uh, I'm not so familiar about uh, so open source so uh, packaging uh, strategy. So if I may uh, wrong, so please correct me. Uh, Rip fifty point zero has uh, been shipped with a uh, Rip six point zero. Uh, actually, six point zero point six or five or something. So this is the latest fresh release. At the release date, so I mean, the, so the 5.0 release date. So, and uh, maybe so, Leap uh, 15 provides the so 6.0 series, but uh, maybe some back, uh, security backport will be provided by the OpenSUSE uh, 
プロジェクト、そう、ユードンウォリアバーズのセキュリティイッシューとユーズはシフトンズ、そう、インターンズはオープンスで15ライフタイム。I think but the, sometimes we want to use the latest,、uh, I mean the currently 6.1 release in open source. Well, it's the same thing. For example, we, if I use a、uh, Uh, Ubuntu uh, 18.04, so 18.04 uh, includes the uh, level of 6.0. But if we use uh, so, uh, Ubuntu long term support, but use the、uh, latest level、uh, of it, it's the same thing.、Uh, so, <laughs> traditionally, we, we, use,、uh, so、we can use the、uh, TDF build. TDF provides the、uh, PDF means the document foundation. Document foundation provides the、uh, RPM or、uh, Debian package. So we can get it and、um, get turbo and extract it and then type some command. So just,、uh, it's not a big deal. But, uh, uh, or so we can use a modern packaging system. So, What is a modern package system? So, modern package system is、uh, so basically sandboxed all in one packaging system. So, packaged with all dependent libraries.、Uh, this is similar to、uh, Android apps or something.、Mm, most of、uh, smartphone applications include、uh, their、uh, related dependencies. So, the, they do,、uh, we don't worry. We don't need to worry about the、uh, uh, so、original system dependency and the newer library or something. So, this,、uh, so modern packaging system solves these kind of things、so、by sandbox technology. And、uh, so, this packaging system is this,、uh, distribution dependent. I mean, the, so we can use the same thing. In the OpenSUSE or Ubuntu or Fedora or something. So, if you want to know about the, uh, uh, deeply more,、uh, Flatpak and Snap session is a、uh, room 301, so we check it, but maybe this is Chinese session. Or so several、uh, packaging system t a l k there are, so please check. And,、uh, Before using the OpenSUSE or any other、uh, distribution to use the modern package system, before that, so I recommend to remove、uh, original installed LibreOffice package. So in, in OpenSUSE,、uh, using the Yast、uh, software management, then search LibreOffice and remove all except lib-0. Lib-0 is a Uh, has a dependency to the lib will kit something. So if you、uh, delete lib-0, maybe system has、uh, something wrong. So I think this description of four lib o f f i c e is a little bit misleading, I think. Anyway, so, okay, so the, I talk about the flat pack first. So flat pack is a So, maybe you can see the whole description in this URL. Maybe you know the f r a p a k Someone knows the, already knows the f r a p a k Yes. Yeah. <laughs> cool. <laughs> of course. Thank you. So, I just, it, I'm a very novice about the f r a p a k but、uh, so、it's very powerful. So, I love it. And so, this is a so application,、uh, Linux application sandboxing and distribution framework. So, so the official、uh, page says、um, uh, Lib15 is released with Flatpak available, so you don't need to do something special in s t a l l a t i o n So, you can use an、uh, integrated. And、uh, so, Flatpak provides a Flathub. This is an App Store or build service for f l a t p a k So we can use, uh, check, uh, get some、uh, many software from、uh, f l a t p a k、uh, of course, including the、uh, LibreOffice. So 
the, uh, the document foundation officially provides uh, built their flat pack package and uh, so they put it on the flat pack so you can take this from here uh, you can see the information from here and take the package from here and to, so important also as I mentioned before uh, we have um, LibreOffice has two uh, stable release fresh and still, but uh, we cannot switch the fresh and still, so we always use a fresh, I mean, uh, so this is a just a note. Okay, uh, flat pack uh, using uh, LibreOffice as a flat pack package is very easy. So you, uh, in browser, go to flat pack and search LibreOffice, and then press install. Oh, sorry. Uh, I hope, alright? Sorry. Yeah, it's still here, yeah, please. Thank you. Sorry. <laughs> I um, forgot to check this. Anyway, so what is the time? So, yeah, no problem. Okay, then. So after press install, the <coughs> maybe the Firefox or Chrome says uh, that what do you want to say running on the program or so save file or something. So um, in in uh, open source default setting, so we open the discover. So I can do this. So in discover, uh, discover is coming up, and uh, so. We see the install button again, so just click. Then uh, type root password uh, several times. So that's all. It's very easy. So well integrated. So after that, so we can see uh, the results here. launcher. So it's a very seamless uh, integrated. Uh, after the installation, so you can use the uh, this is a little bit, uh, this screenshot is a little bit old, so I may see this. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay. Sorry, my open source system is gone, so I just talk in the, this slide. So, we say uh, uh, so at the about buttons, uh, about the dialog, so we can see the flat part uh, strings here. So it is a flat part button. So this is the build on the document foundation itself. So flat part, So important thing in the flat part system. So all system font and input methods are available. So we can, uh, we can use uh, so Japanese or Chinese or. Uh, Korean, so maybe maybe Korean is fine as a uh, normal uh, package is uh, doing that. So <coughs> and the uh, web system integration, KD launcher or uh, so uh, <coughs> extension type relationship or something. And uh, so TDF flat pack package uh, includes the all language packs, so we can use the Japanese trans, uh, trans, uh, sorry, traditional <laughs> Chinese, simplified Chinese, Korean, English, or something else. So many, many English uh, languages uh, we can choose. And uh, no help, but, but uh, so we can use uh, online help instead. So it's not big deal. And so I think Fatpap uh, is a useful for primary office product to see uh, compared to the uh, official Libre uh, Office package. Is by open source project. Uh, next, snaps. Uh, snaps. Some you mean you know snaps? How many know snaps? No. <laughs> snaps is uh, so the same a um, little bit similar packaging system uh, provided by Canonical, a uh, host company of uh, Ubuntu. 
So SLAPs are containerized software packages that are simple to create and install on all major Linux systems without modification. So this is a, uh, so developed by Canonical, but you can use it with OpenGL <coughs> or any other Linux distribution. And the uh, Snap, they have a Snapcraft. This link is a Snapcraft link. So this is a App Store for Snaps. So Snaps has a so very interesting uh, uh, feature. So two interesting features. One, one is a channel. One is a division. So channel is a, uh, for example, uh, like uh, Firefox. Firefox has a. Uh, I don't know about this. So maybe so stable release, beta release, and, uh, and release candidate or something. These kind of the so release channel they have. So uh, uh, Snaps provides a switch these channel. For example, we if we choose the uh, uh, candidate channel, so we can get the release candidate version of review office or something. And the uh, division is a uh, another powerful system. Uh, system. So Snap has all revisions uh, installed in this master system. So with concurrent technology and when the scatter phase. So users can switch easily between each division. For example, uh, I mean, uh, uh, you can revert if some, a newer version has some serious problem. You can revert to the older version. Uh, it's, it's a very easy to switch. Okay, and uh, so about the LibreOffice package, Snap, uh, Ubuntu LibreOffice team provides Snap package via Snapcraft. And uh, so now, so they have four channels um, stable, beta, uh, uh, sorry, stable, candidate, beta, H. It's four channels, but uh, all provide the same version 6.1.043. Uh, so, latest level of stable release. So installation of the Snaps is, uh, of course, Ubuntu already installed the Snaps systems. I mean, the SnapD is a Snap demo of the, this, but uh, so in different uh, distribution like OpenSUSE, we need to install this. Uh, so here is the uh, documentation of this. But uh, so this document still mentions 42.3, but. Uh, it can be applied to the uh, leap 15. Yeah. So this is a command line, and uh, I need to check that what is the time I still have. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so add snap repository, then uh, install snap d, and uh, type this. Uh, SnapD socket uh, in a, and uh, then so like pass or something this of envir uh, environment uh, integration so we do the like uh, have to this then uh, uh, install snap uh, uh, sudo snap install libreoffice something of course, you can switch the channel, so like this, uh, snap, refresh, candidate, level office. But, uh, so, I think currently, so snap system has uh, some bug, and uh, so this command complains some things, but maybe it will be solved soon, I hope. Okay, we can see level uh, office again. Uh, be a very larger. So you can see the 6.1 level office and uh, no 6.1 level office. So no 6.1 level office is a flat, uh, flat pack installed version, and uh, 6.1 has a versioning uh, one is uh, installed by Snap. So of course. 
maybe no one want to install the LibreOffice Snap and Flask. Okay, it's just a um, <laughs> example, <laughs> uh, example environment. But uh, yeah, we can uh, easily understand. If you still remain the uh, open source provided version, so it also says a LibreOffice without version. So if I recommend to use Flatpak, as we will meet. So this is a, uh, about there. So you can see the snap and uh, this release built on by Kamalika Limited. So Omo Ubuntu, but uh, this is uh, still open source. Yeah, it's fine. So snaps has mostly the same as Flatpak, but uh, so so maybe Japanese can understand. This is a little bit. Agree <laughs> font rendering. So I don't know. Maybe so they can find out the system font in opposite environment. I don't know why, but uh, it's a little bit agree. And uh, <coughs> uh, uh, so at least Japanese environment. I don't know how was the other, for example, Chinese or some, something. Uh, but maybe but, uh, they have something wrong, yeah. And, uh, but uh, Snap has, has powerful channel and revision support, and so it is considered to, to check, but uh, yeah, it's not, uh, so yeah, anyway. So, and uh, includes a limited run packs, but uh, only 10 languages, so they have, and includes Japanese and Persian, Chinese, but no simplified Chinese or Indonesian or some, uh, maybe Korean, not Korean. So, so I think these two, uh, you, uh, uh, so maybe so they can find uh, the system UI font and uh, uh, limited uh, language, language path. It's not for usual uh, usage for the, the open source environment. And last, I want to use, I want to recommend to you uh, using app image. App image is the what this app image. App image is the so download an application, make it executable and run. No need to install, no system library or system uh, preference uh, avatar. Yeah. And uh, he also, maybe he, you, you, uh, since opposite guy, you know his. So Richard Brown says, I love, I'm not love app image. I really love app image. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is uh, from uh, Snap uh, Apple Image official uh, uh, page, so I get. Anyway, so <laughs> TNF provides Apple Image package. Uh, this is uh, so HPS. Uh, so, information is here and the download site is here. And the three versions uh, include the run, run packs. Uh, so, three versions. Uh, this is a uh, indicated what run packs included. For example, the single language version is uh, so English only, and the standard version is a limited some uh, several language. And the uh, full version is has all languages. So and uh, so this is uh, so only the taking the package and uh, add uh, execute and. Uh, Sorry, uh, such is the attribute. Uh, uh, sorry, uh, anyway, uh, so make uh, <coughs> executable. So it's very easy to switch several version. For example, the beta or release candidate or daily build or fresh or still uh, whatever you want. Okay, installation is very simple. Just download it, put someone you want. Uh, I prefer desktop is fine, but uh, of course you can use a uh, uh, so, uh, you can put somewhere else. Then add uh, executor permission uh, like this. So in Japanese user interface, but uh, this is a uh, access permission and this is executable. Check it. That's it. Very easy. So I want to demonstrate something. But uh, my 
people through there is gone, so maybe you can see uh, after the session, uh, please call, uh, call me. I can demonstrate to you. Yeah. This is a daily view, 6.2.0 alpha. This is a daily view. So you can use daily view without uh, breaking your system. Yeah, it's very easy. So I think the app image is not a replacement for open source official package or flat pack or uh, snap. It is uh, for people who want to run several versions. Uh, in LibreOffice community. Uh, for example, the quality assurance or test the upcoming version in enterprise uh, organizations or help desk or documentation. So such kind of people want to use the LibreOffice several version uh, parallelly. So uh, if you want to do that, uh, app image is your uh, suitable option, I think. Okay, conclusion. So, if you prefer new uh, LibreOffice, so please co uh, consider you to use Flatpak. I think Flatpak is the best, one of the best way to use uh, Flatpak, uh, uh, use uh, newer LibreOffice uh, continuously. And uh, Snaps has some interesting feature like a channel revision, but not so suitable for user, also the users, I think. So, maybe technically it's uh, very interesting, but uh, <laughs> yeah. And app image is uh, really powerful for testing purpose. If you want to use uh, several so different versions so parallelically, so app image is the uh, most conservative option you, for you. And uh, of course, if you are consultative and need support from open source project, use official packages. Uh, of course, uh, it is a good choice uh, for you. Yeah. Okay, thank you. And so use new uh, River Office in Deep 15 and enjoy your open source life. And uh, I uh, in the so booth, Japanese uh, second floor, uh, Japanese uh, first community booth. So if you want to talk to me, <laughs> please stop by my booth. Thanks. <coughs> Any questions? Okay. I still have a time, so if so, I want to try to my open source environment up. So this is a regression. So 
we have to try the so these these kind of version. Okay. And uh, if we want to so taste newer feature in the master build, I mean the, so under development. So so easiest way is to use a daily build. Uh, so if it's doing such so without building so review office in this uh, their own desktop, so app image is the best uh, option to use that. Okay, nice. Okay, come here. Mm -hmm. Here is the office. I have um, many, 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 many office, but uh, maybe. This is the uh, this is a front part version, oh. and uh, so, yeah. Sorry. Time schedule, but uh, so I'm happy to hear 
we are here, uh, I think, and my talk. Thank you.